pinched here. This is jujitsu, by the way, around. ladies and gentlemen. It's next control. gen. He tries to fight with my hands off. It doesn't matter which one. I want to swim to the inside, bring this hand here, and then trap it again. He's gonna throw a body shot with his other hand. I want to fill the space with my knee. This hand here cups the elbow. And he's gonna switch over here. Same thing. Moving around. Let him back into stage one. Stage three, maybe he fights his hand off my head. He starts to posture up a little bit. Knees in. He throws a couple punches. I let him back down. Stage one. And here, he tries to stand all the way up. Keep the head as long as possible. Push off from the shoulders. Feet right to his hips. Hands are always up. Right, distance management, he can't punch you. So here you're gonna let him back in slow, one foot at a time. Stage one. From here, we'll just go right to five, keep him staying up again. Right, keep him control the head as long as possible. Push off, feet right in the hips. Right now, he's gonna be close to us. Stage four is when he's contact. Push him forward, for right here. So right now, whoop, come back down, pressure. So with the pressure here, so if he's trying to punch you, that pressure is always gonna be here. With whatever foot is closest, so he has that staggered stance, I'm gonna use that for my foot, kind of weird up kick. If his head is there, it's gonna push him back. From here, if he circles towards Patrick, that foot drops, and that's the third direction I go. He goes the other way, I switch feet. Boom. And from here, he rushes me right now. I'm gonna put both feet back up, right to stage four. Hands are always up, he does two punches. Boom, boom, I let him back down. Nice, stage four, stage one, that's right. You guys got that? Okay. Any questions? Uh, can an older person benefit from this sort of training? Oh, yeah. Because I plan on joining you guys, certainly. Yeah. Uh, I do. I have enjoyed uh, folk style wrestling, of course. I talked with uh, Reeves and uh, V over there uh, just a little while ago. And, and uh, of course, wrestling is kind of a religion here in Iowa as far as I'm concerned. So, uh, do you th again, do you think uh, an older person can do this safely and achieve uh, some satisfaction? 100%. Right? So the Greece is actually kind of pride themselves on being safe so there's a lot of gyms that go a little too rough mm -hmm. for people who may show up once to a, to the gym get hurt and then never show back up yeah, that's never so good it's, it's never good this is fire for lake martial arts this is jiu-jitsu and we would urge you to check out fire for lake martial arts okay, okay. I'm mike divine we're out at uh, fire for lake uh, martial arts and next edge uh it's a great facility and uh, these are two of the folks that are doing and what are you folks doing tonight mma uh yes sir ah and you are sir uh, my name is Reeves Hargis. I'm from Winchester, Virginia. Winchester, uh, Virginia. It's quite a drive for you then. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> yes, sir. Um, I'm out here wrestling for Iowa Central Community College. Good man. Yeah, thank you. A wrestler. We love wrestling in Iowa. Yeah. <laughs> What's your, uh, what weight do you got? I, I competed 197 pounds. 197? Yes, sir. Okay. Well, I'm glad to have you here, really. I've been to West Virginia. It's a beautiful state, by the yeah, way. Yeah, it is. Yeah. And you are? I'm V. V, how are you? Good. And are you, uh, where are you from? So I'm from Pilot Mound. Um, Pilot Mound. 45 minutes from here. How long have you been doing uh, uh, mixed martial arts? So I technically just started. I've been doing it on and off from this year to last year. Um, I did wrestle this year for Iowa Central Community College. You wrestled? I did. Outstanding. Um, I'm a big supporter of female wrestling, by the way. Well, thank you. Yeah. I'm a first timer. Um, I actually played basketball my first year at Iowa Central. That's good. Oh. Is uh, is there anything that you can tell us about what you've learned so far that have benefited you, do you think? I've definitely learned like from being here for a couple of weeks now at the new facility. Um, I really learned how to like punch. Um, I've learned how to now kick right. We're still learning how to do that, but mm -hmm. um, I mostly am doing it in case I need to like do self-defense. Sure. Or, um, it does just keep me in shape too, so. Yeah, oh, absolutely. And you, sir? Uh, I'm doing it for competition purposes. Uh, Are you going to be an MMA fighter? Yes, sir. Good for you. Yeah, it's uh, everything I've worked for since I was 12 years old. Um, that's why I came out here to wrestle uh, and just you know get better at that. And then I found um, Five for Lake uh, through um, Tyler Powers because he teaches uh, one of the classes at Iowa Central. Um, and uh, one of my friends uh, last year, Josh Ramirez, we trained at the old facility mm -hmm. for one of his fights. Um, and then, so, season's over, I'm training, I uh, have a kickboxing exhibition May 6th. Um, you do? Where? Uh, Fort Frenzy. Wow, I gotta make that. Yeah, I'll be re repping them. Uh, Are you gonna be in that too, V? No, I'll oh, be come watching, on. I'll be yeah. supporting. You're gonna be cheering? Yes. <laughs> All yeah. right, cheering them on, all right. And so? Um, I just, it's a great facility, it's great because uh, they offer, you know, free classes for Iowa Central students. 
um, which is really good. Um, I like to bring a lot of my teammates. They offer free classes for Iowa Central students. Yes, sir. I didn't know that. Yeah, and so see, I'm uh, supposed to know these things, yeah. but I don't. <laughs> yeah, so I like to I like to bring uh, some of my teammates um, that want to, you know, get get into MMA or just you know want something to do. Sure. Um, and it's just just a ton of fun, and it's a great facility, and especially you know being at you know Iowa Central, you know this this is free for us. Um, and then, you know, the Pfeiffer Lake people are pretty nice people, aren't yes, they? Yes, they are. You know, yeah. They're very welcoming people. And very I've, I've welcoming. In, uh, a lot of gyms uh, all across the country, and uh, this is by far one of the best. Well, it's high praise. That's really nice. Uh, can you point to something that's, that's helped you that you didn't know as far as uh, your wrestling is concerned? Um, yeah, I, uh, one of the great things is, you know, it's a pro and a con, is the pro that they're aren't a lot of people here it's uh more one-on-one -on -one with the coaching um and because it is free for me it's almost like getting a you know a free private lesson mm -hmm. at times and, you know when i bring my teammates it's just it's just us working on whatever we need to work on and it's more structured towards us um con being that because there aren't that many people you know we can't do you know sometimes we can't do too many things um just because there's only a handful of us and some of us are you know for me i've been boxing for four years and some you know my teammates have never boxed so mm -hmm. it's like when we do some striking stuff we can't do too much just because of an inexperience level but um, but again, I just think one of the greatest things is just the one-on-one -on -one personal, uh, personalized coaching with it. Well, I'd like to take this class. Uh, part of my participation will be to show that this is beneficial for an older person, which I obviously am. So I'd have to ask you both not to hurt me. <laughs> if you would, please. <laughs>